you are literally look like you're about to implode. Implode with excitement because Cinderella is coming to the new theatre. So I caught up with the one and only Fairy Godmother. I love the fact that you're having your makeup done and you're leaving me to, to wrestle my own microphone. <laughs> like literally. I hope you're turning over right now. Are you turning yeah. over? Welcome to Wales. Thank you very much. Nice to uh, how do I say it? Sorry. Kloisso Igamri. Kloisso Igamri. You have the most incredible eyes. Oh, thank you very much. They are steely blue. I mean, I could literally swim in those pools. They're amazing. Thank you very much. God. And you're blushing now. I know, I know. You are bloody. Yeah. Look at Luke yeah. blushing. Yeah. You look like Kerry's outfit. Your face has gone the colour of Kerry's outfit. But God, Cinderella is coming to the new theatre. I bet you can't wait, can you? I'm really excited. I love Wales, in particular Cardiff, I have to say. And I know everyone always says that when they arrive somewhere. And you've been doing pantomime for years, of course. Seven years. Seven years. Incredible. Run, uh, but when you were younger, mm -hmm. what was your favourite pantomime to go and see for yourself? Cinderella. It was Cinderella. I loved it. Do you know what? I think actually Cinderella is probably responsible for my career to date. Wow. And I've been a fashion size for 25 years, which means I've done thousands of makeovers. Mm. And so I think had I not gone to see Cinderella with the family wan when I was a kid, then maybe I wouldn't have ever gone into makeovers. Yeah, and speaking of makeovers, speaking of fashion as well. Go on, look at what a segue. Look at that. You are so slick, as smooth as a runway he lands. I do have a question for you. Go on. If you had to uh, choose one shoe to wear for the rest of your life, would it be number one? the glass slipper mm -hmm. from Cinderella, yeah. um, the ruby slippers from The Wizard of Oz. This is a good question. Or my uncle Ricky's Crocs. Oh, Ricky. Ricky's Crocs. I mean, I know Ricky, we've spent some time together. We had a holiday in Marbella, it was nice, it was very hot. Um, he, he wore the Crocs constantly. Mm -hmm. We fell in love, mm -hmm. which was amazing. I mean, there's something about Uncle Ricky's Croc, the smell of that mixed with tapas, which <laughs> honestly, I mean, you'll never, you'll never fall in love stronger.